So Devon Gray of Roseville, Michigan, the National High School Wrestling Championships winner at 103 pounds. And now we go to 112. And the first of two identical twins from California, Shane Valdez, he's in the black singlet against Chris Viola of Virginia in the blue and, blue and gold and Shane Valdez with the first takedown. Viola has gamed his way to the finals. Um, for some reason, I kept catching him. It was a uniform, but he wrestled some really tough. Out of the match. They come back to the center. 26 seconds left in the first period. You were right. Title in California this year. He was second in the state as a sophomore, second as a junior. He'll be attending the University of Oklahoma next year. Signed back in November. They have a injury time here. Rob, you gave me a little trivia earlier uh, about the Valdez brothers uh, entering tournaments. Maybe you could share that with us. Well, both Shane and his brother Dane, who we'll see in the finals at 119 pounds, have had outstanding records. They've led California Chapel to three team state team titles in a row in California, but they've never won a major tournament together. Shane won the state title this year, was second last year. Dane won the state last year, was third this year. And they both have a chance to win a major tournament together for the first time here in this tournament. And we'll, we'll see as the night goes on whether they have a chance to do that. Now Wait. Shane Valdez in on another double leg, and he finishes it. He lowers his level. He must be about two inches off the mat when he takes off. That is so hard to teach a kid. That's, that's discipline. That's great. Well, you can see them as they... As they warm up before a match, they have a drill where they not only work on that level change, but defend their own legs so that they're as difficult to take down as they are to stop that takedown shot. Looks like that drill's working. So far it is, as Shane Valdez has five takedowns in this match, and Chris Viola, who is from Western Branch High School in the Tidewater area of Virginia, Chesapeake, has also had an outstanding high school career. He was the class AAA state champion in Virginia this year. He just got an escape. He was second last year and sixth as a sophomore. No takedown awarded there on the edge. Once again, Shane Valdez in there deep. Viola very bad takedown just about every time. He's getting stronger as the match goes on, Rob. Sixth takedown of the match for Shane Valdez. He has a 13 to seven lead. 10 seconds left in the second period as Viola gets an escape. And Viola, of course, as we said earlier, he's been racking up the points in this National High School Championships too but he hasn't been able to solve Shane Valdez on his feet. All this one-sidedness here, I look up at the scoreboard and we have Mr. Viola only five points down. And when I say only, it just it seems like it was a lot more. You'd think so, of course. Shane Valdez has been trading two for one this entire tournament. And now we'll see how well he's able to get away as we start the third period. Chris Viola of Virginia working hard on top here. We've completed 30 seconds of the third and final period. Now Shane Valdez with the stand-up breaks the hands and gets the escape. 14 to 8 in favor of Shane Valdez of California in the black singlet and he's in on another single leg shot looking for his seventh takedown of the match here and a nice counter by Shane Viola with the far side cradle nothing yet 
Shane Valdez still has the single leg. Now if he can slide out the back door, he might have another one. Looks like a stalemate situation here, and that's what we get from the official. 50 seconds left in the 112 pound championship match. Still 14 to eight in favor of Shane Valdez of California. Chris Viola of Virginia in the blue and the gold had one take down. To 10. Under 30 seconds left in the match. Now looking for a cradle. He's got to turn him in order to get the score closer as we have a stall warning against Shane Valdez on the bottom. Valdez still on his base. And now looking for a tilt as Chris Biol as they go off the edge of the mat. 14 to 10 in favor of Shane Valdez and with two and a half seconds left, it looks like that's the way it'll end. And that's the end of the match. And Shane Valdez of Costa Mesa, California and Calvary Chapel High School is the 112 pound champion in the National High School Wrestling Championships by a score of 14 to 10.